दिस इज अ फ्रूट कॉल्ड हाइड हाइडनोकार्पस पेंटैंड्रा दिस हाइडनोकार्पस पेंटैंड्रा इट्स कॉल्ड गरुडा फला इन और इंडियन लैंग्वेजेस एंड दिस दिस ग्रुप ऑफ प्लांट्स दिस हाइडनोकार्पस आर quite a large family some 30 or 50 of them are there and they are spread out in the tropical asia from india to thailand burma indonesia philippines and all, various species of this group this hydnocarpus group and india itself has uh, some probably about half a dozen variations and uh, this one it occurs in uh, moist and uh, uh, moist and uh, semi deciduous uh forest and then uh, along streams and all in this uh, western ghats region then uh, while showing the general location and a little bit about this it's growing on a stream uh, stream side actually on the other side uh, it is uh, the trees on the edge of one uh, arecanut farm somebody's arecanut farm is there and then at the edge the tree is growing as a hedge tree and uh, there is a it's a cool nice place moist evergreen and then there's a stream flow is there most of the year from um, april may to monsoon little bit it will dry up and then immediately it will start flowing so in this kind of location this uh, hydnocarpus pentandra is occurring naturally then uh, it grows up to 25 meters tall it is good 60 70 feet quite tall and uh, looks also quite nice then uh, it's a threatened species the numbers are falling drastically and uh, moreover it's a very valuable species because it has a lot of properties useful properties uh in ayurveda and uh, the seeds uh, that fruit is a kind of a woody kind of fruit with the uh, smell and all is not very pleasant or anything if you break it open and some flat seeds are there inside and uh, another thing that seeds this flat seeds inside they can be they take out some oil it's called chaul mogra oil or something uh, yellowish oil and that uh, that seed oil is a very important uh, medicinal item uh it's uh it's used it has numerous properties in ayurveda uh, anti inflammatory leprosy then it's also tonic uh, item and then wounds uh, healing ulcers and all kind of uses are there if you want to know more you can search in some ayurvedic uh, book or on online i'll just show the plant and give a rough description uh then uh, the fruits are used as a fish poison it seems so that's one of the use apart from that uh, it's be- becoming endangered so if uh, people who have farms and all can can consider having a few of these on the borders and also in biodiversity gardens and all it's a good tree to have that is the hydnocarpus uh, pentandra i think it's garuda phala 